Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? We might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. <laughs> what the fuck? So, what did you get? A lot of stuff. Not very a lot. Fine, by the way. Nice work. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The winter? We'll freeze our asses off here! Because piling into an RV with you two, after what you did to my dad, is so appealing. Why wouldn't it be? You know I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health, but he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. At it again, are we? Can it, Carly. Hey, don't be mean to my bitch. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable anymore. We're strongest together. It can't be you versus us, Lily. We're sorry for what happened to your dad, but we're in this together now. What about the food situation? What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you... We got plenty of food from that station wagon. You didn't even want to take it. Where the hell would we be now? We I can't don't just know. Keep our I'm trying to fight with you, station Kenny. Wagons. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? What the Some fuck? I thought you wouldn't tell her. out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. She gave us enough time to get everything we could out of the drugstore. What the you fuck, Kenny? Let her suffer like what? Like bait? God, what is happening? The we fuck? We needed. It was just something that had to happen. Lee's right. Kenny, let me down. Lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. No, it, Look, it actually was. Bacon and its people aren't savable. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. It's not going to be easier out on the road! How would you know? Run him what over. I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's right. Stealing! And I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day! You're going crazy. Everybody get out! Bitch. You're going crazy. She'll get over it. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. Oh, look at that balcony back there. I remember that. Ooh, things are coming to a head. Oof. You can say that. <laughs> and then she said oof, well, and then she said head. <laughs> I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks. It's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. <laughs> oh, 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 okay. Can I move? No. Okay. 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 Let me check on Clem Clementine. Clem Clementine, how you doing? Yeah, it's coloring a paper, piece of paper, hey, all black. Okay. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we went to the botanical garden once. Okay. See, it's the same. Oh, that's what you're doing. Kind of. Oh, that's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere else. I don't know. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah, that'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Um, okay, I guess. Let me just go talk to Carter. <laughs> oh, oh. Talk to Lily yet? 
No, not yet. I will. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot about you. Oh. What about? You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. And I think people should know. Why are you so because pissed at you me? deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. Yeah, I thought we were going to have sex. It was a lifetime ago. Which is only going to make the feeling that you hid it and that there was even more to hide that much worse. People might be pissed. And telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what will happen if they don't hear <laughs> Far cry is a game. Yeah. So you'll do it then? Yeah, fine. Don't let people know. You're totally right. Good. I think it's for the best. I guess we're switching positions now. And so... And so now I'm your bitch. You'll thank me later. You're not my bitch anymore, apparently. <laughs> Now, I gotta go out on their own. <laughs> okay, let me just. You really think people are ready to hear about me? It's not a matter of ready or not. There's never going to be a good time, but there are going to be a lot of bad ones. Right now doesn't seem like one of them. But everyone's different. Who knows how each person would take it, you know? Maybe it's worth thinking about who you want to tell. I'm just so kind of. <laughs> Do you feel safe here? Show me a bath with a heated floor and a high-rise apartment and hand me a full-bodied Malbec and then I'll feel safe. I don't know, this place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her, that's Are you a lesbian? She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Okay, I'm no you're not. Okay, good. Thing. Good idea. I taught you well. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I kid, I kid. Okay, where's Kenneth? 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 I'm not gonna tell you, bitch. I don't even know you. Sounds like Kenny actually has that thing running. I don't believe it when I see it. Where the fuck is Kenny? Kenneth? That did not. No, I guess I can't. Apparently, whenever I go over there, it switches to a different scene, and then there's something blocking my way when there's nothing there. I'm not gonna tell Lily. Anywhere. Where the fuck is Kenny? Oh, there he is. Yeah, talk to him. Hey, you two. How are you doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. Spat? We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know. But I'm not getting used to you it. Better. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Kenny, you got a second? I need to tell you something. Sure, pal. What you got? Racist, Kenny. <laughs> it's serious. Oh, no. What'd the she-devil do to you? Shut up, man. I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's, different from everything. This was before the Walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and, you know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, yeah, right? I saw you do that. Yeah, I did. And you're talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Shit. Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course. Then shut it. You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Okay. Guess that's all that. <laughs> um, catch you. See what catch you think. No, I'm not gonna tell catch you. I'm gonna tell Lily, and then I'm gonna make her pissed at me even more. And I'm gonna get myself kicked out of this group. I'm sorry. You don't have to apologize. Did you come in here to give me hell or to coddle me? 
I wanted to follow up on what you said about stolen supplies. Do you know what's going on? I don't. I just heard you mention it. And you came in here to confess? I'm not stealing shit. I came in here to help. There's a traitor. Somebody, one of us, out there. He or she or they have been taking it's Ben. For real? Who? What do you got? Yes, for real. And I don't have shit. I just know. It's Look. Ben! It counts off and it's the good stuff. Antibiotics, oxy, fuck, anything with opium in it. I see the count, and it's fine. It's Ben. I keep my own. That one's getting messed with. It's Ben, I'm telling you. I'm a fucking mess right now, but I'm not stupid. I know what happens if I start a witch hunt. So you want me to start one? I want you to poke around. Ben! What's there to go on? I found this tossed into the garbage. Huh. We don't toss out equipment, we fix it. You'd only try to get rid of a flashlight if you were using it when you shouldn't. Okay, I'll poke around a little bit. Thank you. If you don't find anything, I'm just going to assume it's you. The fuck, man? I need to... A mystery. Oh, you shit. Jesus, Doc. I'm sorry. I heard you you guys little talking. shit face. You need to unhear all of that. Can I help? What did I just say? You're the Grace Detective, and I can be Dick Grayson. You're Ward. You are Dick. Haha, <laughs> it's silly guys. I called you a dick. That's Robin. I know who it is. Ah. Uh, uh. You can't help. And if you tell anybody, it will be trouble. Secrecy. Did you hear what I just said? I won't tell a soul. The part about not helping? You can't help. I will live in the shadows. Okay, what the fuck? What was that music? <laughs> 